This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what. Welcome you back here to St. Francis Homecoming. Boys, come to the action time. It's a rematch of a game we did on Dr. Martin Luther King birthday and the St. Francis Palati Panthers on the road. 12 and 13, must win game for them to have any shot of getting in the MIA A Conference playoffs. The St. Francis Panthers, top record in the Red Conference, overall record at 28 and four, trying to get number 29 here today, here at homecoming. Pilate with the ball first, stolen, the ace all by himself. Lays it in. Two nothing game early. As Blunt had a turnover on the other end. Pilate had a tough loss at home against Mount St. Joe's on Friday night. St. Francis, as you've seen here on the Dinosaur Network, defeated Gilman in their last encounter. 67 to 57, a 10 point win. Post and ace kicked off. Arashia Jones knee from McNair trying to get the pass in. 14 seconds on the shot clock. 717 here in the first so far. Ocean Ace swings in the Ortune. Ortune against West, a matchup to watch there. Blunt, shot clock at four. Inside the Malloy, he puts the two in the tied up. Miles Lowry. Lowry with the two. Don't confuse with Lowry. And Jordan Toes on this is shot miss. Fortune with the rebound back to Blunt. Huge one here for Pilate. Matchup still left with Boys Latin. And Calvin Hall, that shot tipped and missed. And Oya as well. So a lot of games still to come. Inside, Jordan Toes lays it out. Four two game. Blunt. Off the screen, gets the ace. I go to McNair. Blunt again. Floats it off the glass. High did not go. West gets the rebound. That comes the Panthers. Nice dump off. Murphy. As I was told, excuse me, he was blocked. Jump ball. The jump ball. The ball should go to Pilate. No, we'll save with St. Francis. As this is the battle of the St. Francis of the basketball. The cats today. Got the blue black cat against the yellow and black one. That was St. Francis. And we've done it's not a knife game of St. Francis this year. Back over West. Blocked! By Malloy, a foul is called. West coming up to the line to shoot. Foul call number 12, Isaiah Oshanaya. Shanae with the foul call. Shooting two. Right side of the line shooting a pair. First shot, front end miss. Second shot, front end. So two front end misses there. Ocean Ace. Hit it back over. Blunt. McNair from downtown. Hits it. 5 4 game for Pilate. The ace now. Baldwin pulls back. Front end miss. Murphy had the rebound. It's going to stick with St. Francis. Don't know about that one. Well, Francis, St. Francis got a gift there. Technical foul problem number one, Adrian Ball. Wow, the ace got a tech. I wonder, I, wow. I wonder what happened there. I, 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 wow. <laughs> so all I can say is wow. I don't know what happened. But a technical nonetheless is called. 
Below at the line, hits the first. Second shot, in there. Two huge free throws. And an early 7-4 lead here for the Road Panthers of St. Francis Pilate. And again, for Pilate, every time they touch the floor. As we talk about the DSM for we went to the playoffs. Oh, that, oh, that's five seconds. Five second count. And Cole. the ball back to, to St. Francis. Panther, St. Francis basketball. Okay, now Troy Hackley to catch himself like I do when you have teams with the same name going at it. Jones, Murphy, Toes, Jones, and Travel. Pilates basketball. Pilates gets it back. Again, the bottom part of the MIA A Conference Red. Blending country with eight wins. Plotty with six themselves. And Gilman and St. Francis put an end to their run yesterday. McNair. They go to Malloy. Malloy back to Blunt. Blunt trapped in the corner. Falls on the deck still. And finally, St. Francis gets it. West keeps the dribble. Jones. Toes. Jones back to the ace. Back over. That's a foul. Second team foul against Pilate. Foul number 12, Isaiah O'Shanaye. St. Francis basketball. Jones wide open for three. Hits. Jones for three. We're tied at seven. Blunt brings it out. And against the ace. Blunt. Nice kickback. McNair for three. That one didn't go. Out of bounds is going to go back to the Toes kicks it back. The ace for three. Hits it. It's a 10-7 game for the homecoming Panthers here at St. Francis. Swings it back. Malloy. Go to McNair. McNair pulls back for two and drains it. Jamel McNair. 10-9 game. Toes. And a foul against Pilate. Hey, foul call number 13, Jamal McNair. Jordan Toles, shooting two. Toles shooting a pair. Toles missed the first free throw. Second shot is in two. So both shots go. Actually, not both shots. One of two, excuse me. And it's 11-9 game. It's blunt. I think went off the knee of the ace, though. Somebody's going to keep it on their end. Blunt. Brings it up. Brings it back. That's a three. That hits! McNair with eight points so far. Out of 12. Jones right back. He didn't get that one. Rebound to Malloy. 
Oh, good game so far by Pilate being played. Toes. Got to steal somebody. Ace pulls up. Did not get the three. Toes offensive rebound. Block was inside. Two shots coming up. Nice hustle on both ends. Back on number two, Anthony Blunt. Jordan Toes shooting two. Toes shooting a pair. First shot in there. Second shot. Try to take the lead back. That one didn't go. Spent out. Otoon with the rebound over the block. McNair again. Hits again. 14-12 game for Pilate. The ace. As Jones pulls back. Toes on downtown. He hits. 15-14 game. Panthers of St. Francis, that is. Do not want to open the door back out to Mount St. Joe's. Kicks the ace. Back to toes inside. West shooting a pair. West at the line shooting a pair, one point lead there for St. Francis at homecoming. What a huge matchup it is, and so far both teams are playing like it. And St. Francis still has Glendon Country on Wednesday, and then they and the front end missed there. Then they get Mount St. Joe's and a huge one. Try to finish the only conference loss. Oh, a well block by West. Oh. Oh, Malloy, inside, and that's two shots. Johnson's coming to the line to shoot him. 128 here left in the first. Johnson line shooting the pair. First shot goes. Second shot to tie it up at 16. That does happen. Even Steven at 16 here late in the first quarter. Screen the ace. I see Jones got the pass. Back over the toes. 20 on the shot clock. Murphy. And he walks. Swings it back. Or tune from downtown. It spins in and out on him. The ace. Jones for three. Hits it. 19-16 game. Johnson. Johnson, 27 seconds left. 10 second dips in the same clock in the shot clock here. Blunt. Fakes it inside. Lay up the holes. Mallory having a nice start to the game along with McNair. 
Five, seven, six, five, four, the ace. Swings it back. Jones again for three. That one missed. McNair. After one and a high paced affair. 19 18 affair. One point lead for St. Frank. for Pilate. Got to get the wins now. They're at six. Brendan Country. At their plateau. They're now eight. We've seen them against the Latin Lazarus Christian. And they played Pilate earlier in the season as well. Then you seen the Al Kaiser in the last right now. But Malloy. Didn't get it. McNair tried to finish it. No good. Actually, I'm sorry, that was uh, Blunt. St. Francis basketball. But it went out of bounds anyway, and St. Francis gets it back. Tolls with it now. He brings it up from Jones on the inbound. Swing it back over. Jones back to the ace. Baldwin. Tolls for three. That one didn't go. Nice box out there by Old Tune. Back over to Blunt. Shorter lineup right now. Malloy couldn't get it. Nice snatch rebound there by Alexander, the freshman. And yep, should go back to Pilate. It will. Substitution's coming in now. Again for the Panthers, this is St. Francis Panthers, that is, excuse me. This is their third game in three three days here. They've all been at home, but again. A team that likes to run fast pace. So you can be a factor. And indeed, again, Mount St. Joe's only have two division losses. And if both tie, Mount St. Joe's will, will be the top seed. And then Friday night, they play each other at Irvington. And that should be a huge one. A rivalry game. BCL, St. Francis is good. That's a foul. And that's Smith. He's coming up to shoot, too. Actually, I'm sorry, that's Carter. He's coming up to the line to shoot the pair. Foul call on number 30, Bitoir Montague. Josh Carter, shooting two. Carter, the line shooting the pair. First shot, in there. We are dead even at 19. Second shot in there. No, no good. Looked good, but it didn't go in. Ace with the rebound. Since last Sunday. Oh, miscommunication. Basketball. So St. Francis is six game in the past week. We have done four of them here on the Dodge Point Network. Three of them make up games, my coming games. It's not timeout by 
Timeout, 5.02 here left in the first half in the tie 19 game. Speaking of other games of St. Francis, you can go on the Dice Right Network right now. Check them out. Check out the uh, Mount Campbell last week. And the big one against Boyce Latin, St. Francis to prepare. The one yesterday against Gilman. Checking us out now. Back as well, that big time pass the back. We have it right here on the Dice Right Network. That's full game for you. Check them on out. Yeah, Baltimore metro area home here in Baltimore to sports action. McNair and bounds to Carter. Carter got it tipped away from him. Nice steal there by Busby. Alexander to the ace. He's off the screen. Pulls up and hits. McNair against the ace off the screen Smith turned it over Baldwin oh must be couldn't save it in time and Pilate gets it back 522 here left in the first hand Legs is Carter. Popped in the air. It's gonna stay with Pilate there. Pilate basketball. Might as well tune back in the game. She's gonna inbound it. A lot of schools on the football in has homecoming, St. Francis. Tradition. Even with the football program as good as it is now. Still keep the basketball one. And the only ones that does. A basketball homecoming on the boys and girls side. Or tune against Busby. McNair against the freshman. And a foul. Foul ball number three. Take on Busby. That's it. Uh, <laughs> Low inbounds over to Johnson. Uh, that one tipped in there. Ace for three. That one. I right, tapped it back out. Nice hustle there by Buster. Swings. Jumper. That one didn't go. Out of bounds. Pilate gets it back. Foul call number three. Take one. Busted. Foul call. Pilate basketball. Both teams at five. This team got two remaining for the one and one is in effect. Swings it back over. Malloy, Fortune, swings it back, swings it over. Picked off. Montague, back to Alexander, no good. And the rebound over to Johnson. Swings, McNair, got it in. Tie game. Alexander back over to the ace. Fakes it. Ooh, what a move. And a foul is caught. Foul ball number 33, Miles Mallory. Adrian Baldwin, shooting two. Okay. Oh. 
First shot by the ace. No good. Second shot. Got it. One of two and a one point lead. Back to St. Francis. Oh, two. Got it over to Johnson. Look what Johnson that is. Brings it back. Two with it again. Two back to Johnson. Back to McNair. McNair against the freshman. Pick City. Stanton. Lays it up. Time out. Pilate time out, 24-21 game. Three minute mark here left in the half. Again, the key mark key for both teams. But Pilate trying to keep their player hopes alive. Like the magic number to get that final fourth spot. The MIA conference is eight. St. Francis, they're trying to keep a hold of the top seed overall. Boys Latin would love to get back in it. If another loss happens by St. Francis, they can still have a chance to be the one seed in the MIA playoffs. Stay aggressive! Stay aggressive! Doubled. And able to get out the track. McNair for three. Fun and miss. Whoa, look out. Should be the 16th. West with the foul. Both teams at six. One more time. And the one on one being the fact for each. 2.40 left and a half. The tune. Kicks it back. Carter. Ah, oh, spin down on him. Murphy grabs the rebound. Jones. Back over the toes. Jones has it again. Stan. Toes. Murphy. Swings it. Three ball. Missed it. Platoon. Back over. Johnson pulls up. Ah, oh, spinned out. Platoon with a rebound. An offensive one, that is. He pulls back for three. That one didn't go. Here comes Jones. Side to West. He's been neutralized so far in this one. Stanton. Jones. Tolls. 126 here left in the half. Tolls for three. That's front end miss. Nice offensive rebound by Stanton. Got it over to Jones. Fresh shot clock. St. Francis. Francis calls time. 113 left in the half. 27 seconds left on the shot clock. A wise timeout, I'll say by coach and athletic director Nicholas Lamb. Regular season, by the way, for St. Francis today. 
their last two games will be on the road, Living Country and then Mount St. Joe's. And they'll be back. Definitely, they will definitely host at least one playoff game for the MIA and of course the BCL as well. Swings. Inside, front end miss. Back comes Pilati. Back to three. Hits it, we're tied again. Oh, McNair again. And we're tied at 24. Toes. 17 foul against Pilati. One and one. Four, Hill 2 Jamal West, Shooty 1-1. Shot's in there. Second shot in there. Twenty six, twenty four game. Shot clock, clean clock, ten seconds apart. Inside the corner. I could get it out of there. Barely did. Blunt. Got a mismatch. Nice top off. Carter couldn't finish. The ace. Five, four. West, three, two. I see Jones from way downtown. Hits it. He's three to go in a half. Halftime. 24 games for St. Francis. They're over. Pilates back with the second half here on the last leg of the Second half about to get going here. I'm on side here with you on the dice on the network. It's homecoming here at St. Francis. And the boys right now. The, the Panther in the white today is up by five over that Panther in the black. Big matchup for both ends. West inside now. The ace. Hits the three. Maybe Pilate, this is what you don't want. St. Francis is really getting in their offense. McNair, Blunt, or two. That's an ace. Blunt for three. That one tipped and missed. Rebound to Murphy. Over to the ace. Dumps it off. Jones back to Baldwin again. That one time, that one didn't go. McNair snatches the rebound from the air. Bad it. The ace took it away. Three on one fast break. Toes. Jones. Oh, man. He was looking for a highlight. Didn't quite get it. West reversal goes in. Over a minute into the third, Lottie down 10, 35-24, 34-24, and this is what you don't want, control the pace of the game. Back here to game action. Tune back to Blunt. Back over. 
Pull up. Got it. Oteen with a big bucket there. Toes back the other way. Missed it high. West. Shooting two. First team foul against Pilar. Foul number 33, Miles Mallory. Jamal West, shooting two. West at the line, shooting a pair. So, Bell, keep your eyes on the ball. You turn your back. First shot. No good. Funny miss. Second shot. Got it. 35 26 game. One of two there by Toes. Shanae's back over to Blunt McNair. Back over to Blunt. Hello, Shanae's. Over to Blunt. Kicks it. Shoots it all. Tooney hits. 35 28. The ace. Nice pass. Murphy. Rejected from the entry. The other way and side block from behind. Ball back to Pilate. Swings it to McNair in the corner. Fortune hits it. That's a three. And the lead back down to four again. Side to Murphy. Murphy missed it high. West saying that it was tapped out of bounds off of him. Off of one of the Pilate players and the ball's going to stick and stay with him. Toes to the ace. Ace inside to West. West, what a move. Ball got stuck. Jump ball is going to go to Pilate. Man. Talk about a huge turn of events. Pilate, very early in the quarter, was down 10. They hit a two or even a three hit, it can be within one. It's an ace. Good D and D. Got to do something with it. McNair pulls up, spins it in. 35-33, two-point advantage here in this one. Jones for three, hits it. Jones. 38-33, three back to five. Blunt off the screen. You see now Malloy. Bat it in the air. Smart move to let it go. Pilate and the ball's gonna stick with the Dark Panther. Then we have these two when they met on Dr. King's birthday. Fortune. Faked it. Malloy. Ten on a shot clock. Malloy inside. Oh, spin down on him. That's what he wanted to do. Just didn't go. I see Jones. Dace. And a foul. Foul for the shot. Believing that is the third team foul. Well, I was second. Might be second. Rashad Jones, back over to Baldwin. 
Uh, out of bounds is going to go to Pilate. Ocean Age intercepted that telegram. And Toll's trying to get it back. Knocked it out of bounds. Drive, Wilson Ace, high, didn't go. Ace, on the right, Jones. Inside the Bogan. Shot it high. Wilson Ace with the rebound. Blunt. Bluntly lays it in. A little dazzle there. Senior getting Pilate within three. Toes. Jones. Offensive foul. No. Got the basket. Got the basket and one. My apologies there. One day I got a quick couple here in the quarter. 41-35 game. McNair. Doubled off the screen. Otoon. Side of foul. Two shot foul. Here come foul on number 20, Jamal West. Will O2, shooting two. Two shot foul. First shot. In and out. Right there, give him some clarification of blind. He's a junior, but then program stuff. We got him down as a senior, so he, he classified one of two. Five point lead still to St. Francis. Ace. Alexander. High three ball. Went up top. Gonna go back to Pilate. Pilate basketball. Two A here left in the third. Back over. Missionaries back to Blunt. Blunt off the screen. Inside! Oh, I got it two in. Three point game. That's it, Jones back up. Pull up jumper, Jones. Jones. Singer nailing another. 43 38. It was. Alexander swings over to the ace. Thank you, Side. And 
West shooting two at the line. Fourteen foul against uh, Palladia. Foul call to number 33, Miles Mallory. Jamal West shooting two. First shot in there. Second shot here, yeah, it's bent out. Carter, more back the other way. Inside, a blocking foul, two shots coming up. Foul foul number three, take one, Busby. Busby at the foul, 36.9 here left in the third. First shot, in there. Second shot in there. Four point game. Trying to back to Jones. Alexander back to the ace. Shot clock at 12. Ace for three. Didn't get it. Whoa, look out. Foul is called. West coming up to shoot two. Foul called on number 11, Nasir Edmonds. Jamal West shooting two. West hits the first. Second shot, in there. Three, two, one. And the third quarter. Went very high, and after three, so 46. To Please don't forget to visit our photo booth. We have free photos for you today. Next time you see us here on the Dashway Network, weather permitting, will be St. Paul's and Crusaders up against Curly. Big matchup in the MIT Conference. And then we'll be back with you, Mother Permitting, again. Taping Tuesday should be on Wednesday. Murphy and Patterson. And then Patterson and Clifton on Valentine's Day taping. I'll be with you on the weekend here on the Dodge Play Network. And then next Sunday, we will be at Stevenson for the IAM Basketball Championship CBA Conference. Greek and Catholic in the CN. Open for uh, Mount Desales and Mount Camel. And the BN and in the end, we hope for that Roland County, St. Francis to her meeting. That's what we're hoping to see here on the Dive Swimming Network. And that'll be coming your way next Sunday. Taking here the hey, fourth quarter. About to get going. His toes about to inbound and he does. Alexander with it. Ace for three. Hits! Uh, a huge three there, in my opinion. 49 40 game. Nine point advantage here. Time is slipping for Pilati. Oh, whoa. Many collision block against the ace. Toll switches on him now. Blunt drives inside, no good. 
West grinds the rebound. Back over to Alexander. Alexander back to Ace. For three. Spins it in! The Joker card has been hitting the Aces, giving it on. Carter couldn't finish that one. Toes. Ace again. Had to fill himself there. Almost went in, not quite. Back the other way. Turned it over. Bust beat. Actually, my policy, Alexander. Got it in. And the score has quickly moved up to a 14. Body got to take time. The grass, bro. Trying to get that fourth spot in the red conference. It's rapidly slipping away. Here it is. 637 left. Still got games left with Boys Latin. Boy and Calvin Hall make up. But again, this is a huge one here. Inside. That one didn't go. Lloyd gets it in on the third chance. 54-42. Alexander with it. Toe. Spin move. Oh, didn't get the finish. Oh, look out. I'll stand with St. Francis. St. Francis basketball. West. And he traveled. Traveling call. 559 left, Pilate down by 12. Again, St. Francis needs to win. Set up the matchup with Mount St. Joe's. They beat Mount St. Joe's. Went out. Panthers top seed in the red and top seed in the overall MIA in conference playoffs. Try, pull up, front end mess. And it's going to stick and stay with Pilate. Pilate basketball. Picks it. Spin move. Blunt. Blunt. Crossover. Blunt again. Bad it. Sticking with Pilate. 11 seconds on the shot clock. 516 left in the game. Clock. Ace. Ace picked him. Ali! Oh, 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 oh. Boy, oh boy. The air show took off there. 
And if you didn't see it, we wind it back and take a look again. That's the power, Ace inside missed it high. Here comes the ace again. Back behind the pass, Alexander. Dagger three! Alexander for three! 59 42. A dagger three. The team almost got picked. Double team is blunt. Inside, got it in there. Edward Johnson. Time out by St. Francis. Yep, there we go, 59-44 game. 4-15 left in this one. <laughs> Back to game action. Coming down the stretch in this one. Race to Alexander. Ace pulls. Dips it. Back. Reverso lays it up in. Carlos Alexander. Oh, man. The freshman getting it on. 17 point lead for St. Francis. Just like that. Ball in the air. Platoon able to grab it and keep it. Got the roll. Nice. Good recovery there. 15 point lead. Back over to the ace for three. No good. Offense rebound to West. Toes. Inside to West again. West. Spin move. Kiss on the side. Malloy. That's the three. Ocean A's are spinned out. Fast break. Alexander. Pull back. West inside. Kicks it back. Toes. Dagger! Jordan Toes! For three! 66 46. A lot of playoff chances fading here. Rapidly. And so you gotta go. Weather for many, of course, against Boyce Latin. Still got Loy and Calvin Hall left in the season. That's a three from Johnson, no good. West gets it. St. Francis about to get their 29th win of the year. The ace. A little extra icing for Lesnar. Man, an offensive explosion here in the fourth quarter for St. Francis. For three, for Blunt. Ah, oh, went in and out. Ocean Ace, nice hustle. On the baseline. That's a long distance, too. That hits. Time out. 146. 20 point advantage. St. Francis. Yeah. Susan Eason in the back. Got to be able to play the floor. And, and he was actually doing a good job on the guard. On the defense as well. Yes. Yeah, what? The time of the substitution one. I said it, my, I said it myself in my head. Huh?
Back to game action in St. Francis. Trying to wrap up their 29th win of the year. Here on homecoming. 140 left. Alexander back to Toes. Toes. That one didn't go that time. Offensive rebound though for Busby. Inside foul is called. Two shots coming up for Jordan Toes. Yeah. Give it a funny part. Let's go for the minute. Probably with 40 seconds. Can you put him in with 40 seconds to go? Uh, I do still need these bucks and I throw it out of the game. I need to do what I throw it. Now for number 15, Isaiah Lattimore. Jordan Cole, shooting two. Thank you. Second shot, in and out. So the subs are in, got both time in this last 90 seconds. What's up? Pull up. Blunt hits. Long distance. Substitution. Taylor. Ball went out. Francis, Francis gets it back. 105 left in this one. Homecoming has been a successful one. It's going to be a clean sweep for the St. Francis home front. Last home action of the year in the regular season. We know the girls in the postseason, they're going to be guaranteed two games. They win their first, of course, in the playoffs in the I AM. Fakes it. Taylor. A jump ball. Fifty-four point That's a three. That one tipped and missed. Rebound. Dad Busby. Taylor to Stanton for three. Stanton high. He missed it. Back over. Turner counted in one. 26.8 left. Take one, Busby. Josh Carter, shooting one. Carter. Got it. 70 55. Then Boyce Ladden. Five second count. Twelve point four left. Pilates gonna drop to twelve and fourteen on the year. Had some ups and downs and they will get boys Latin. That's three hits. Isaiah a war. And that will do it. It's gonna go in the books as a twelve point defeat. Final score, St. Francis 70 and Pilate 58. 70, 50. St. Francis Academy thanks you for your support. Homecoming today. We say so long to you here on the Dive Sunday Network. Homecoming day. Weather permitting, we'll be back with you for an NIB conference tomorrow with Curly and St. Paul's. If not, then we will have matchups for passing this week. Mervo, hopefully, weather permitting, and then, of course, against Lake Clifton. And then next Sunday, we'll be back with you in the IAM Championships at Stevenson University out of the ones met. I'll see you tomorrow. Say so long to you in the dive swing. Now we thank you. Checking this out at St. Francis Homecoming. And we will see you down the road.
This is Die Sporting Network.